who I am, and why I use Linux. This is me. My name's James R. Strickland, and I always wanted a Vax. I grew up with computers. I had one of my own from the time I started junior high school, a Commodore 64, but it wasn't until I went to college with my trusty 64 in tow that I encountered a real computer, a Vax 11750, one of the campus mini computers. That was the computer for me. Multitasking, virtual memory, I wanted all that. Unfortunately, the Vax was the size of a big file cabinet, several of them by the time you got drives and so forth attached. By the time I hit graduate school, in English I should point out, I was running mini computers, doing VMS and Ultric system administration. Desktop Vaxes had appeared, but they were thousands upon thousands of dollars still. My career in high tech started doing frontline support and management on PCs running a proprietary Unix called ESIX, and I started to think that this, maybe, was a Unix machine I could take home. And then along came this thing called Linux. Like ESIX, it ran on PCs. Unlike ESIX, it was free. It was the early 1990s, probably 1994, that I first downloaded Linux on the PCs at work onto dozens of floppies. It took a while to get it running, but it was the early days of the internet and my wife and I wanted our own server. I've used and administered Linux and Unix-like operating systems at home pretty much ever since. Computers have gotten more powerful than any of us imagined. Why do I use Linux? It's what I always wanted, even before it existed. 